Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Banished. We're using the Mega Mod in our town of George. And this is the co-op series between Night Ghost 49, Vapa Gaming, and myself. And I ran it for a little while through the winter to get into spring here. And while I was doing that, you see all the question marks of our miners that are out of work. But that one is almost done, 91%. And something did pop over here we'll look at in a second. But while I was running it, I was noticing that that uh, we've got stone over here mixed in with what was a uh, keystone. So I decided to go through and pull out all the keystone and, and normalize it to stone like uh, Vapa had done over here. So keystone really needs to end at about this point. And I did put it in here already because that's what I saw over in there and rather than rip that all out we'll just leave that but we'll use the bridge as the divider but i put in a double road over here i thought that would look better which meant i needed to move all the houses around to even them out so i realigned uh these three rows basically and yeah so we're getting there bridge has got to come out these two buildings are got to come out to move the footprint back one space it was easier to see in the snow you can't see it now um line should be back over here anyway tinneries are all in now we've got to make sure we've got crops to run in them I did get a comment about uh, how I had missed uh, corn in the soup kitchen the soup uh, tinnery it was there I just went right past it Let's see if I can find it again there it is we don't have any in stock right now or growing anywhere so we're gonna go with wheat for now which is dangerous because that then taps the wheat that we're using for the the uh, windmills, the, the mills, and uh, the bakeries. So we're going to have to replace that soon. Have we got... See, we needed to get... Let's pause here before too much time goes by. We needed two spinaches, and we needed two leeks. So this guy's going to be leek. I wanted three of everything. I don't think we're going to get it unless I really cram in a few more fields somewhere okay so two of everything so far two peas two beans two spinach two leeks um, what else did we buy at the end there cucumbers now we don't actually have corn I didn't find it so I didn't buy it is that correct that is correct so and it's interesting how I said corn instead of kernels when corn makes kernels so I'm still not absolutely certain on that. I'm going to go with cucumbers. There was something that took cucumbers. I think it was canned. Yeah, I think it was a vegetable tinnery. Um, okay, so we're going to do cucumbers there. Let me think about that. Hold on. We'll just leave you paused. Because the three vegetable tinneries are taken care of now. Bin, uh, bean, pea, and spinach. And this is where the cucumber was. So now it's not going to help us. Will any of those three work in the soups? All right, we have leek in both. Leek? No, no. No, I, that's right. Bean, pea, spinach. So leek is meant for one of these, that guy right there. So what else is an option for us? Uh, where was I now? We found leek. Let's try this again. Leek's right there. Turnip, soybean, kale, ginger, barley, wheat, rye. So none of those are an option, and cucumber doesn't land at anything else. So cucumber is not going to happen. So maybe corn is our goal to finish off this last soup tinnery. That'll take care of that one. Over here, we're good on the fruit. So meat is the next issue. So before we get to meat, though, let's make sure that we've got everything chosen so one two three more fields available and I did plot buildings into here so we can't try to squeeze one more into that space would it have fit if it would I'm willing to put the buildings right there so let's just check that out field we came off this corner can we get a 10 by 15 um, 10 is this way not really. We'd have to shoot out like that. Some odd... Hmm. Let's think about that. 17 times 6. Let me type that in here. Huh. 
102. Okay, not even close. So I can't get it around 150 squares out of that thing, so not worth it. Up here? What is the biggest thing we can do? 99. Nope. So this is pretty much done for crop fields. Okay, so we've got three left. What are they going to be? Hmm. Tomatoes did really well. That's why I, I did uh, so much with them. I'm thinking here. Yeah, let's see some numbers. That's not it. Tw over 1,200. That's numbers you usually don't see. Usually you max out at 1,000. You are an odd shape. We get 1,100 out of you. You're a tiny little thing. Oh, you're herbs. Okay, 200 a year. Uh, peas. 1,000. That's a more normal thing. Blueberries, 1,000. Blueberries are for muffins somewhere? No, no, we're not making muffins right now. I'll have to go check on that. Beetroot's 1,000. So tomatoes are just excessively uh, productive. Raspberries, 900. And 1,000. Beans, 1,200. So beans are doing good. Kernels? What? Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Do that again. Sunflower makes kernels. Oh. Okay, I had that confused with corn kernels. Or corn... Yeah. Okay, so kernels are sunflower. Corn is corn. I get it. Okay. Um, so beans are doing really well, and tomatoes are doing really well. Do we have the option of bean soup? I didn't see it. But let's just rule that out for good. Didn't see it in there. No bean in there. Okay, no bean soup. Which to me is quite odd. So, hmm. What's the plan? Is there anything over here that we wanted to convert to something else? There's always that option, too. Let's go with that option. Let's get three of everything, including something over there. Yeah, that'll work. All right, so spinach, beans, peas, and leeks. Let's go for those four. So you're going to be a leek, and add one, and we're good. And then bean and pea over here, and then something over here. So you may have already started planting, so it won't hit till next year. But something over here, raspberries weren't doing that good, but we want to make sure we've got some, uh, you know, a lot of sources of fruit. We're not using the sunflower for anything in particular. Hmm. You can make an oil out of it, but we're not doing that. So let's switch you over. And there's still two of two people working there, so we'll switch that out too. You are going to become... Not bean and pea. So, spinach. Okay. So beans and peas are going to be those last two over there. Well, it's easier to remember. Any other twos? One, one, one. Now we've got them all cleaned up now. Alrighty. So farmers, 49 of 48. I'm still off by one. Okay, get that going again. Everyone can start uh, planting. And we need to get some houses out here. So this is still not going to run efficiently yet. So we need to get more houses out here. We put uh, three of them right here. Something like that. There they are. One, two, three. Let's put one of them up here to see. Now what popped over here? The medieval hardware store. And this doesn't do anything more but just change the roof color. Okay. So I'm not going to worry about that right now. We'll take you down to to three and we'll add three people in and let's go over there that's this guy right here what are we gonna do for roads here I couldn't well I could have flattened all this out to, to step him back I wish I had now because it'd be nice to have a nice road right through here without it jogging around but let's 
I assume everything over here is stone. Yeah, let's put a stone road in here somehow. Where's a good view? But we'll keep it out at the at the level of this guy, and then we'll step into the forge. Foundry. That should work out fine. And then we'll get back to meat, what I was talking about earlier. So, let's see here. Stone road. It's going to go in this position, out like so. And like so. We're going to... Oh, let's country path into the doorway. We'll not let you with this model. So that's going to take some squares. Okay, some ghost squares. And this one... Actually, that will have to be stone all the way in. We have some real heavy carts rolling through. All right, that and we'll do a second one there. Yeah, something like that. Okay, so that's done. How's this area doing? So we got all of these in. We could put more in. Are we able to maintain this guy now? The tin is here. The oysters are here. They're being stored here. Yes. And quantities. We're looking at, wow, over 600 a year being made. Now, pop into, I can never find that thing. There you are. Oyster, we are by name, halfway down. Oyster, 151. So we are ahead of the curve now. Good, good, good. So, in that case, General Warehouse, where are you? What am I looking at here? Oh, okay. That is uh, storage. Really just needed the food ones, but General, I believe, took food as well. So that should be fine. So I got these two going in, and it's already spring, so they're not going to make it. So we'll catch that next time. Anyway, over here, we've got meat to think about. Now, I thought about chicken, but it seems like the chicken pens... We don't have any chicken pens, do we? Actually, we do not. We've got milk pens here. We've got sheep pens here. But I don't recall putting in the egg pens. But anyway, the egg pens do not make much in the way of chicken meat. So a chicken pasture is here. And this guy, boy, how big would you say that is? A 12 by 12 maybe? I think it was 12 by 12 is bringing in, as far as meat, 110. Not a lot. What are you bringing in? You? No, you. No, you. <laughs> chicken, duck, chicken breeder. Chicken meat, 20. It's gonna take a whole bunch of them. But it does make feathers. And that's something I made a mistake on a couple episodes ago. Or maybe last one? I recorded a whole bunch of them, so I don't remember which one now. I was looking at our clothiers and realizing that we weren't doing anything with feathers. I forgot we're doing a whole bunch of stuff with feathers out here. Uh, this row? This row, right there. Two, four, only four? Six, eight workers using feathers and reeds to make survival coats. That's probably what the majority of the 1700 is, survival coats. So we do need to maintain our feather supply. Let's peek in here. Right there, feathers. Right there, just so you can pass me. 2700, we're doing okay. Doing okay enough that if we have enough reeds, we can even add to that. Reeds. That starts with an R, doesn't it? There you are. 8,000. We got plenty of reeds. Hmm. But the goal was to find chicken meat. And I really can only do that if I do that. Alright, what kind of... Okay, beef, bison, and... Both beefs are all being butchered over here. You are the sheep butcher, and you can't find enough mutton to keep working. So deer, and over here we've got cow. You've been butchering up, oh, five, six and a half, 650 a year. Hmm, okay, how much beef do we have? 100. 
What do we want to can? How much chicken do we have? Where are you? Chicken, zero. Okay. We've got this guy going in is where I'm, I'm thinking right now. What goes in there to help supplement one of these guys? So, tin chicken is not happening. Uh, the other meats for these two. We've got fish over there and fish over there. We're going to run out of fish before long, too. So, we could try for beef in this one. And chicken is not going to maintain. I'm sure there's not enough bison. Is bison? No, bison does not come in as beef. It actually comes in as bison. Because we've got a bison butcher who doesn't have enough meat either. Hmm. And our fish supply right now is what? 1,500. Okay. So we're getting ahead on fish. We put in the one extra and uh, here and the one extra over there. Hello. You're not in yet. Ah, okay. You will be soon. Dark mine went in. Down to... Why do we still have 20 people out? I mean, we'll take you up to 20. And add the 5. Let's keep adding until... Maybe it just happened and those 20 haven't found... That must be it. Those 20 haven't found their jobs yet. Okay, we just went even. So is that correct? Miners? Four more. Okay. I was clicking faster than it was it was making up for over here. Almost turned that off, didn't I? So this guy is supposed to be making ore, right? Iron? You're coal, you're iron, and you are a mix. You're actually creating iron itself, whereas you are iron ore and you are coal. That's right. You are out of business. Why? Can I find enough fire bundles? Be even though we're making over here like crazy. Let me see the numbers over here. Um, we've got the workshops here. And it seems like Nyko's added some others. You added this one. Okay. So you are making fire bundles. We have plenty of reeds, so we'll take you up to two. You are two and two, two and two. And I didn't check. Are you all fire bundles, right? Yes. As are you. Okay. That should be enough fire bundles to keep this guy going. It really should. We're not making charcoal out on this end anymore. That's up there in the forest where the logs are. So all of this is reed based over here and we have plenty of reeds. Okay. Bunch of houses like I just put in. Let's go peek over there at those. See if those footprints... Oh, they did go away. That whole area went away. Yeah, I got a bridge missing. I gotta go replace that. Alright, so these are being built. Let's come back to these in a moment. I wanted to put in the double bridge through here. And to do that, we're going to have to take these guys out and put in... Now nah, we'll figure it out. So, themes, key wall, ghost, put in a three wide. Hmm. We go one past was that far how do we want to do this let's delete these two and put in this guy here that works and we'll put a diagonal after it so that's done it's just delayed and then we need this to be right about here so let's take this guy out and we'll have to uh, kind of piece that together well, I love it that the uh, delete is on this this uh, menu here now. So put in a three again. That is ghost, and put a single. Don't like using the singles unless I absolutely have to, because it uh, it changes the pattern of the the posts right there. That didn't work, did it? 
Okay, I got that one wrong. And I expected to be able to delete it from there. So I can't do that. So, let's see. This guy... Alright, let's try that again. But from this angle. That's what we want, right there. And... Unfortunately, we're going to see the shore under this one. We could try and drop the level here. Do this one first. Is it that one, or do I want to be here? We'll try that one. And... Oh, I hate to do that. Let's do this one. We'll see how they react to the one next to it. Okay, that worked good. Still have a left slope to, to make it look real. Okay, back into themes and key, house, ghost, single. Yep, that'll work for now. And we'll probably diagonal out of there later. So with that, I believe we can put the bridges in. I hope that they will not uh, react badly with these pieces. Let's find out. That bridge is the one that we... We special ordered this guy. We want the... Ah, boy. Where's the map at? If you build from this direction, left is left and right is right. I think if you're facing north, it is too. Otherwise, you get the mirror image. So I'm hoping I can do that. Okay. What is the problem here? You're fine. This is road? I believe that's road. Okay, let's take road out of this area. And let's uh, prioritize that. There we go. Alright, with that gone, because it looked like I was fine from this end, right? Yeah, we have a... We've got a purchase over here, but I don't have a landing. I think it needs to go to right there. Okay. All right, we'll come back to that. Anyway, these guys need to be built in. Boy, we've got a major house building project going on here. They're bringing materials like crazy. So we need an end over here. That is housing and these guys. Hey, got the right one. Right there? I believe so. And then this guy... And F. There it is. No. That's not what is missing. What's missing is right here. And think about that. Dormer. Non-dormer. Right there. So theoretically, that's done. I'm just got to wait for it to build. And then all of these folks that are in the boarding homes will finally have a place to live. We've got quite a few around the map, don't we? We've got that one, we've got the two original ones over here, and they're empty. Good. Then we've got these over here, the hostels. There they are. And kind of hard to find the footprints on these. There's that one. This one's on this side, right? Yeah, there's that one. And then there's the one in the middle. So, second and third floor are full. This one, that's top floor, empty. Middle floor has got somebody in there. Bottom floor is empty. And what do we have here? Upgrade your medieval hostel for better look and warm. These will upgrade, really? I didn't know that. So just a, is it just a different look? It says that it will make it warmer. Huh. Well, maybe we'll play with that. It takes uh, uh, bricks and logs and the roofing tiles. How are we doing on those? I'm going to check that for a little bit. Then i got, got to get back to what I was working on originally. Don't know what that was now. <laughs> i got a list. All right. Bricks. 500. We're doing good. Roofing and... Oh, we have plenty of logs. Actually, wow, we're down to 2,300 logs. We've been doing some building. So, roofing. Where's that little red symbol? Missed it. There you are. 7,000! Whoa! 
we need to be selling some roofing tiles. What do we have in inventory? 12%. Yeah, let's add roofing tiles. Let's put a thousand in here. We need to do an emergency food purchase, which we might soon. We're at 56,000. Uh, roof, there you are. Then that, I'm not sure what they're worth. I've never sold them before. We'll check that out now. Roofing tile 5. So there's 5,000 more available right there. So that's good. Do we do it over here? We could put 500 over here. There you are. Yeah, let's put 500 in there. Okay, back to tray. Turn you off. And... So back over here. Did these other two farms pop? They did not. Because we prioritized so many other things instead. And early summer... You would think that we would get done. Am I running at one? I am. Let's go ahead and prioritize these two. While we're early enough in the year that we're not worried about uh, interrupting them picking things up. What is that? That's beans, isn't it? No, that's sugar cane. And that is bamboo. Yeah, we'll, we'll stay or stop a minute here and look at the new crops. But guys, once you get these two done for me... Great, and that got done. So we've got here leeks. Oh wow, they do look like leeks. I'm curious to see what they look like in their full uh, form. I'm thinking they'll be more green, a little bit taller. Over here, these are spinach. Eh, not the right color green. Spinach is a darker green, but let's give it the benefit of the doubt and see what happens when it gets to the... Uh, the last stage of growth. Maybe it'll darken up. Then we've got... So that's the sugar cane. That... What would that look like? That's peas? Hmm. I guess so. Be nice if there was like a, a trellis in the model there. These are beans. Yeah. And then we've got peas and beans. Okay. Out over here, what have we got? Your raspberries. That's beans. Sunflowers. Which are going to be switched over to spinach next. And blueberries. And beetroot. Yeah, okay. So beetroot as compared to sugar beets. All right. And you are oats. Trying to make a few more domesticated animals over there. And peas. Okay. I think it represents pretty much everything. <clears throat> Although there's tobacco leaf. Yeah, I think we're done now. So that's quite a few raspberries. That's tomatoes. Okay, tomato, tomato, tomato. And do we need more tomatoes? With all that we're doing right now, are we maintaining? I feel like the game is kind of <laughs> lagging on me. Um, tomatoes. Still 2,600, so we're holding. Okay. So, to make more chicken, we're not going to get it out of chicken pens, or egg pens, because that makes eggs. I can't do anything with eggs over here, right? I mean, I can make all kinds of eggs. But they don't have egg drop soup, do they? No. Okay, that's not going to help. Huh. And there's no eggs in the meat. What else is in the meat? There's actually quite a long list here. Fish, beef, mutton, venison. Hmm. I haven't checked venison. That's something I just kind of forget about. It's just a, you know, a background thing. The venison, the the, the, the hunters out there in the in the forest nodes. Pork, seal, oyster. So we don't have mussel. We have duck. So duck and deer. Let's go check quantities on those. Those are kind of the wild cards. Those are not 
well, they can be produced in a uh, pasture, but we're, oh, sorry, we are, we do have a pasture of ducks. That's right. So duck is 600. That may not be enough to maintain. And the other one was venison. Venison cuts. Venison 100. No. So, kind of striking out there. So beef we were staying ahead on. So I guess what it comes down to is we're going to have to put cattle in here and, and maintain the beef. Though we did that already, right? Meaning we did already choose beef. You are ten, you're chicken. We've got fish and we've got beef. So it's really the third one we've got to figure out. Though beef is going to run out. It was only maintaining from the butcher. So we're still going to need beef in this one. And this one's been a long time, so we need to up the priority on that one as well. Get that guy done. Um, Got to go check our bridge over there, but dock fishery. Let's make sure this guy is up and running. Add four more. Let's go look at him. He's this one. Good. So that one is done. He's got storage over here. And we have rice in there now. There's already storage over here, but they, they were full. Weren't these at 99% a couple episodes ago? Because it was full of food, and we're half, half our food's gone. Ah, okay. So, let's see here. He's fine. What's been happening in here? Stack burner. You are up in here asking you to make more charcoal. Out of logs, yes. So, let's employ... I never thought about that. How many were working in this one? I see your smoke. There you are. Two people. Okay. So, it's not like I could have just added another worker. Put two more in there, get that going, making charcoal out of logs. Done. What else? We have a forge over here. Let's go... The dark mine is done. You're done. Okay. And no more. You know, that was odd that 20 people didn't go back to work. Just had a thought. Before I do this, there wasn't, by coincidence, another mine out that we just didn't notice, was there? Let's just go check the mines out real quick. I think we'll be looking for a white circle like, uh, well, not like that. It'll be one turned off like this if the mine is down. So I don't have that anywhere in this area. And there are no other mines except for the tin mines. i got to take you back down. There we go. Except for the tin mines, which are over here, which are just too new to even think about them going down. So that is it on mine, so it was not a mine issue. Okay. Still waiting for this guy to finish. We can park him in there. So we've got all of our forges going now. Which I'm sure is making iron at the moment. So that's you for tin. That's right there with furnace fuel. And we still have furnace fuel in the area. Here. 450. Here. You're going to be hard to get a hold of. There. 300, so we're still good. And in the market, 66. And these are all little stalls. Was there a a uh, uh, material stall of some kind? Or are these all food? Material, another 18. Okay. Okay. So, roads into here. Didn't quite get that done, and we didn't get another storage for the tin over here which probably should be on this road. Let's put that one in real fast. And then we will road... Actually, I guess we better road first. So we need to get from here. We need to integrate the uh, the, the found forges and then get back into here. And we also need to tap this guy with a road. And over on this side, we're using the keystone. So let's just continue that pattern. Although we've got... Uh, yeah, regular stone over there. But this is keystone here. So that should be keystone. Hmm. Maybe I'll change that in between episodes next time. Alright, so it's going to be hard to see through these trees. But I'm thinking we need to tap off of this guy here. Come this way. To... Let me get to where I can see the entire thing. So I don't have to lose where I, was, where I, was, where I left off. Now... Let's go to there, and then let's diagonal in to 
the front of there. I think that'll work. And then we will take this guy straight across. Yeah, that does it. Okay. So that connects all of this. And straight across was right in there. So now let's put in the the uh, material warehouse. Down on the road we just put in. Right there. So they're going to drop off there. These guys are going to pick it up right there, the tin. And these guys are just going to have to go traveling to get their tin. But will they be traveling over a bridge soon? That's the next question. Road, bridge, and I believe I have to face north. Let's see if that is correct. Left. Still doesn't work. What have we missed here? Does it work on this site? Does not. Are there, are there road tiles in there? There are. There's a road tile right there, although it didn't work here. That's an issue. Well, maybe I'll take these guys out and uh, put them back in later. See if we can make this work that way. There. That is so strange. This one requires this for the one wide, but the three wide didn't. Odd. And we've got road hiding in here. There's the issue right there. That's what I couldn't see. So that goes away. Okay, so prioritize this one. We'll come back and try it again. All of that prioritize. Alrighty now. What else? We have these houses going in. Um, I wanted to play with these tracks one more time. Because that was bugging me while I was editing. Now, this came out pretty good over here. I'm thinking that that is one straight piece, or one diagonal piece in there. So one diagonal, and then curve, curve. And that makes a fairly good, compact turn. So he's right here. Okay, remember that spot. And... That one is this one. So that spot there? <laughs> I think it's right there. Okay. And then the other one. There. Yep, that's it. And a straight. There. Straight. There. That one goes away. Alright. That should be it on that one. And this one we're going to say is good enough. Alright. So that gets us our curves through here. Alright. What other uh, issues that have not been cleaned up are hanging, out, hanging around out there? Uh, tin storage is in. Chicken pens aren't going to do us any good. Unless I put 40 of them in. Yeah, 20 a year. That's, we're going to need a lot. So I don't think it's a good use of our, of our labor. The game hasn't crashed after accepting those nomads. I am surprised. Where am I at now? Going on 40, almost 40 minutes? Okay. Um, I've got more fish. Houses over these guys. Let's do that. Do we do all of them? I'm tempted to leave these three alone. In fact, I kind of wish I'd done the opposite. Two, three big ones here and, and, and leave the small ones there. Wouldn't that look better? Kind of stair steps down into the market. What do the front of these look like? Well, that's more... I guess, no, that's a clothier. Okay. This is the one that looks kind of plain. It's just a hardware store. You know, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to upset some people who uh, don't want to be forced to move, but uh, 
eminent domain and all that. You go away, and you go away. And over here, we're going to put in three two stories. That is where you medieval. Right there. Right there. Okay. And we'll just... Hmm. How do we want to aim this? I think that's a good contrast. Well, oh well. Oh, I don't know. It probably doesn't matter in the end. Although, I don't have the ability to do that here, do I? Unless I turn you around. Would anybody notice? Probably not. Unless I put the gables that way. Oh, I'm hitting something back there. No, you go here? You do go here. I'm losing it here. That is correct. This one is not correct. Right, that one's wrong. Okay, let's try that one again. And I can't go there because we don't have enough space. Interesting. And when this was put in, this sidewalk was not there. So he is going to have to move over to do this. Do we? Huh. They're all going to be staggered off, aren't they? Out of sync with each other. They're bouncing one way and these are bouncing the other way. No, these are going away back there. Okay. Oh, well. So he's going in. Let's put one back over there. And get where I can actually see the back. You go right there. Okay. And what do we do here? We're not... I don't know if I can take the sidewalk out. I did not find... Oh, there it is. So I could take the sidewalk out if I wanted to. Do I want to? I mean, we, we meshed up here really nice. Hmm. How would we curve out if we did that? I think we're stuck with that. I think we're just stuck with a, with a little building. They look like they've, like they've got almost the same, uh, same storefront too. Fruit, food. So one of them with a a uh, roof over the top and one without will make them look different. Okay, that's good enough. This is all in. All right. So what else? Need to end this episode before long. Um, farm trader in the harbor. Okay, that was left undone. So we want to get a farm trader in here just to find out if the traders can make their way up this little creek over here and get into this. And if they can, <clears throat> that will open up the door to move these guys in if we want to. Problem is, they've got their supplies right here. They've got their storage right here. It's going to be a big undertaking to get all the supplies to this area and new places to store things. So that might not be wise other than just doing it as an experiment. And that's what I should have started the episode with, huh? Because I need this to go away. And I don't want to take out those tomatoes. Where else could it go? That's That was the, the spot and the thought. I could go somewhere else. If I did that, where would I do it? Is that what this island's for? Huh... That could be. So let's look at this carefully. The river's over here. Oh, they can still get in. Okay, I thought that was sealed off. So we may not get the, the drama of moving up the, up the creek here. Hmm, let's put a, and which one? Let's put food in. Let's just face reality. If there's one that we're desperately going to need someday, it's probably going to be the food vendor or food merchant. So, trader, food, looks like that. And 
you are going to be a booger to put in, aren't you? You are. Okay, try you this way. No. But I want you there. So let's just make it happen. Uh, let's go to... Let's go this route. And curve you over. Like that. I think that can be hidden by the model of the trader. Food. Yep, that worked. Can I go in one more? Almost. Where do we want this to be? Now, this is where I kind of messed this area up, didn't I? Or Vapa may have done that. It seems like there was a time when there were people stuck out here. And he quickly made a land bridge. And then I went through and tried to clean that up and didn't do a great job. Let's, let's see if we can butcher this a little bit more. Now, this one, unfortunately, brings it all the way up and uh, level again. And this one's underwater. So there's no way to do both. That didn't work. Okay, let's try that again. I would have thought that that would bring this square up. Why is it not? There it goes. Okay, so we have a little bit of a curve again. Let's curve this guy and probably take this one out. I need to see what its final form is going to be before I can uh, uh, place the, the trader. So let's go in with number three. I've never really tried to make mountains with this. Let's stop there. Okay, that works. Let's take... You're a two, so I gotta take... Actually, I can... What happens if I do that? Okay, that brings it all up. Which is where it should be. The river does have uh, some shallowness to it. So let's bring all of these to a two. Alright, let's see what that looks like. Hate to do too much because it's really hard to make it go away afterward. Alright, so that's going to be there. I see we need to do that here and here. That's looking better. I'd love to get rid of that one. If I make that a two, what happens? Yeah, it, it takes it away. Well, that'll have to do. And I may have to take this away a little bit, too. Let's make you and you a number two. And can I do that one also? I'm getting close to that foundation there. Eh, not too bad. See, it doesn't smooth in between. I wish we would do a better job of smoothing. And we need to get this guy out, and I think we're done. So you're a two. Right there. What does that do? One more? That's looking pretty good. Okay, I can work with that. Back to Trader food it kind of needs to be right about there that's a little bit skinny to get a uh, uh, boat through we need to be outside of this so we can put a, a bridge through there so we need to lower those three spaces can we find those three spaces? And... Oh, that's not it. Resume. This one. Was that them? And did that do any good? It did. Ah, there we go. Okay. So he needs to be... No, we aren't. He needs to be there. Ha 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 ha. 
Okay, so it's right in there. Let's just try that one more time. We'll just make it work. I don't think I did it. If it didn't, then you get the general idea, but I will do this off camera. I want it there. Well, okay, we're down to one space. We can just locate that one space. That is correct, right? Yeah, there's more to repair. Okay, I'll come back to this one in between episodes, because I can see me spending the next 25 minutes trying to get that one right. And it's about time to turn this one off. So, is there anything else I need to cross off on this list? Um, just more fish. Where can we put more fish, dock fisheries in? Now, we've got the key dock, or key fisheries. Which might give us some... You know, justified buildings that would look good in here. Somewhere. Don't have a lot of building spots actually sitting here. Let's see what that looks like. Fish. Okay, what are you? How do you build? You pop in just like that. Well, we do have this spot right here. It's not going to be overly efficient. But it would function. Let's do that. You're going to go there. And... Do we do one more? Well, you're not going to be... You're going to be overlapping zones there. I don't want to put you in front of our tins. And I can't put you diagonally. Our canneries. Um, you could kind of squeeze in there, I would think. Eh, not really. So really, we would need to develop more shoreline to do this. So that's not going to happen. Unless we got up into this lake over here. Um, I just realized we never did restock these guys, did we? Let's do that real quick, then we'll call it done. Um, let's look at numbers for 10. What has been happening? Though it's not anything we can trust yet. It's not been enough time gone by. Ten, you're coming up. There you are. Ten, thirteen, almost fourteen hundred. Or twelve hundred. So we're running even there. With few ten workers in the in the uh, forges in, in the foundry. So if I up the foundry, we're going to need to up the, uh, the mines. And to do that, we're going to need some houses built. Okay. So let's balance this out next time. Give this a little bit of time to, uh, to get built. In fact, maybe I'll run it for, you know, six months or so off camera, unless something uh, exciting happens. We almost got everything picked up, but a little shortage in labor over here. Hmm. Food? 4,700. Yeah. So in between episodes, I'll also do a major food purchase in here, too, and and try to... Uh, Try to get us ahead and, until the tin, the tinneries or cannery row actually gets fully functional. Then we'll see uh, yeah, how that balances things out. So let's call this one done for now. I would appreciate it if you hit the subscribe down there if you haven't already, and the uh, uh, the thumbs up if you would. And remember, this is a co-op series between Nikos Forty Nine, Vapa Gaming, and myself. So check out the other guys' channels as well. I'll catch you later, folks. Bye bye.